Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. Getting down low today because uh, I got my shitty tripod out because the good one is broken. I need a new one. Anyway, I got a 2015 Silverado behind me and it's a really pretty color. And I figured I would do a demo for you, like a live demo of like before and after. Now, I'm gonna detail this whole truck, but this demo is just gonna be on one panel where I'm gonna use Evo shampoo, the wash and protect uh, on like the front door. I'm gonna hose it down, I'm gonna wash it, I'm gonna rinse it, I'm gonna dry it, then I'm gonna spray both, both doors and you're gonna see the uh, beating action, which means the protection is being left behind. And uh, that stuff's pretty amazing, so. Awesome. Pretty amazing. I wanna show you firsthand what you're in for. So, I got my Evo shampoo diluted uh, one ounce per gallon, which I use one gallon and about six towels to wash a whole car. Free rinse. Okay. Notice it's dead, flat. Now, this truck actually hasn't been washed since uh, he bought it, he said, which is over a year ago. So what you're doing is watching me wash this door with Evo shampoo and not clay barring, nothing, just washing. Hey, how are you? It's really dirty, so I'm giving it a good scrubbing. Uh, I am gonna be applying the force field protection system onto this vehicle. I just wanted to do this demo for you guys real quick. But anyway, so that's that. Clean enough for the demo. I don't want to go grab one of the good ones, the gray ones for the demo. I'm just going to show you with this. Just get it all dried up. This is one of my old towels. This is old school right here. This is like the beginning of the detailjuice.com situation towel. Probably, that was probably eight years old. This is not the best towel in the world. That's for sure. <laughs> for drying, look at that. It's just old. The new gray ones uh, that are on detailjuice.com are pretty amazing. I like them a lot. I like that they're smaller than this too. That's really what I dig about them. But anyway, it's pretty dry. So, you can see, obviously, I cleaned that side, and I did not clean this side. So, man, it's a shitty towel. So, here goes nothing. I'm gonna hit it with some water. I hit this side with some water. She's dead. This side beads up and works very well. See the difference? Huge difference. That side actually has some protection on it. Um, it would work a lot better if the contaminants weren't preventing, I mean, this thing is highly contaminated. Now the difference I'm trying to show you is that this is flat and lifeless with no protection and this side obviously is beating. Now it could be tighter if 
the surface were free of contaminants, which is why I suggest that before you start a regimen with Evo shampoo, as far as it being the protection that you're using, I would lay something else down, like the force field boost. You could wash clay bar and apply force field boost, then start to use the Evo shampoo. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to wash the car with the perfect soap, clay bar with ghost or whatever you want to use, and then wash it again with Evo shampoo. You would just use force field boost as a detail spray, like you were you would if you were maintaining infinite force field and just lay down a layer of protection and then when the car needs to be washed then you start with evo shampoo that's the point but it's very clear that this side has nothing on it and this side definitely has some protection now again if this side were clay barred in fact i'll even do that demo live so for example i'm going to use because it's clean, I'm just gonna use the water as the lube. I'm just gonna go right into clay bar in it. I'm gonna remove all the contaminants, or at least the bulk of them, and then I'll hit it with Evo shampoo again, so you can see how much tighter, without all those contaminants, the beading will be. Yeah, it's pretty contaminated, you can see that. Pretty gross. All right, so now that door is clay barred. Remove any loose com contaminants. Then All right, so pretty dry. So now again, lifeless, and we have beading action. You can see the difference. Um, again, like I said, I would use Evo to maintain infinite force field. Uh, or force field boost that you laid down first. That would be my recommendation. Um, you could use it as its own thing and only use it, which gives you awesome protection. I mean, it's obvious that there's protection on this side and not on this side. Beating, no beating. So anyway, that's been Evo Shampoo. Just a little demo I wanted to bring to you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. 813-846-4406. Check out DetailJuice.com and check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It is a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products. So if you guys want to be a part of that, send us a request. We'll get you in there talking to other people, reading stuff all about DetailJuice.com products. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.